And here's your Caribbean report for tonight. <music> In Dominica, Dominica has joined 56 other member states and governments and 14 observers of the International Organization of La Francophone in celebrating the organization's 40th anniversary. The National Commission of La Francophone, CNF, joined with Dominica Association of Foreign Language Teachers and French Teachers of the of the primary and secondary schools and organized a number of French related activities which began in the month of February with a competition on the DBS radio program Francophone. In St. Kitts, an official of the Caribbean Farmers Network, CAFAN, is of the view that even though St. Kitts has only recently turned into a non-sugarcane agriculture, because of its farms, organizations, and relatively young age, the country has an advantage over the Caribbean neighbors who have been into agriculture for a long time. The regional official who was in St. Kitts last week, where he held several meetings with stakeholders in the agriculture sector, sector also met with members of St. Kitts Farmers Cooperative Society, LTD, where he held a candid talk with them and pledged Kafan's support. In Haiti, Colombian pop star Shakira met with child survivors of Haiti's earthquake on Sunday as her charity prepared to build a school in the disaster-stricken Caribbean country. The singer, who has already joined Hollywood actors and other global celebrities to raise funds for the victims of January 12th's earthquake, flew to the wrecked Haitian capital port of Prince aboard a private jet. At the planning site of her new Barefoot Haiti School, she met about a hundred children, some of whom danced to her song. And that's your Caribbean report for tonight. And help is on the way in several housing communities in our territory. It's all about making our neighborhoods cleaner and safer. Here's Wes Small with the story. Thanks a lot, Jerome. Today we are in Williams Delight, where we have an initiative going on in the housing community with Mr. Gaston Tuckett. He is the liaison uh, to VI Housing and try to uh, reconcile some of these problems we have with our environment and violence in our housing communities. Today, it's Williams Delight. My name is Gaston Tuckett. I am the housing community liaison for the Virgin Islands Police Department. and. I'm here working in conjunction with the VI Housing Authority uh, doing assessments of their housing community and trying to make a difference in terms of providing uh, security for our residents and making sure that they're safe in their environment. Um, we have undertaken this task based on the assessment and the criminal activity in the area and found that there was a need to do some major initiatives in here to, um, again, reduce the crime rate in Williams Delight. Um, I've done the assessment of all the housing communities, and um, right now we have um, an initiative that will be ongoing in the Mali housing community. And uh, uh, right now we're basically waiting on the electrician to do his survey so that Wapa can go ahead and put up additional lighting in that community. Um, in St. Thomas, we have impacted the Kerwin Terrace with a major push there, where again, in conjunction with other entities, to include Waste Management, Public Works, and WAPA, and the Abandoned Vehicle Task Force. Uh, we have cleaned that community, installed additional lighting, and have done all the major cutbacks and cleaned the guts to um, do some mitigation for flooding during the hurricane season. They can call uh, my office, which is our uh, 776 one five two five or they can reach me directly at nine nine eight zero eight two eight they can also speak to the respective managers in their community who will then forward that information to me well there you have that Kerwin Terrace in St. Thomas being uh, looked over with proper lighting and um, the movement removal of abandoned cars you see here in Williams Delight this initiative is certainly moving to success and Marley housing community in Frederickstead that initiative will start going immediately after this one. In Williams Delight, I'm Wes Small for News Channel 8.